Hey everyone, today we are going to go over this Pressa Turbine. Got this today, it's made by Pressa. It's a polishing kit for, you know, working on your vehicles and stuff. So we'll open up this box and show you what's in it. Pop that open. Goodbye swirl, hello shine. Open it up. Here we have your carrying case for it first off so nice case for all your stuff you get in this thing open it up just a basic case in there you got pockets in the sides of this case you can see there's a bunch of pockets both sides have pockets so nice big case for there get inside you got your terry cloth here start off big terry cloth and we have your rotary pads. There's your hard compounding pad, six inch, right there. Your six inch sanding disc comes with it. So, there's that. And then, that would be the manual for it, right there. We have another waxing pad foam waxing pad and a medium polishing pad so it's got all sorts of different heads for this and then we got a cleaning rag here buffing rag these are nice to have I always use one of these to clean my car with they're great you can throw them in the washing machine after you're done they get nice and clean and they do not scratch the vehicle so these are awesome for cleaning and now for the good part to the motor itself okay so we have your handle and your other handle here pull that out get that cardboard out of the way so have the handle two different handles there so set that down out of the way now we'll move the box so there's your tools and stuff in that little thing so we'll get rid of the box move on to just this guy here now this thing is heavy it's like solid heavy duty tool here got some weight to it for sure so let's uh put this thing on so there's your handle here and we put that on looks like it slides right over top kind of clicks in place there there we go It'll kind of adjust where you need it. This is the rotary teeth and your handle here. So you can go right or left handed. Screw in that side or over here in that side. Hold everything in place. So that's nice to have. We'll set it in this side. Screw that in. Get it tight. There we go. So, there's your tool, right there. Power switch. So, yeah. There's your adjuster on the back of your speed. Turn it up, it'll go faster. We'll plug it in and take a whirl with it. Pull out the sanding pad. It attaches. Now, your pads and everything attach to this thing. This is a Velcro edge. And so the back of each one of these pads has that fuzzy velcro on the back so pretty simple you pull that little plug off here's your threaded area goes right on there and threads right on just spins right on if I can get to line up properly Let's see if we can get that to go I'm sure we need the tools so we'll pull a tool out and show you how to get it on Okay, so inside your little box of tools, you have your Allen wrench, a couple bolts. I'm sure we'll figure out what those go to. I'm assuming this bolt goes right there on both sides if you want. So you don't have to have a handle, you can just have this or vice versa so you can just have the handle 
You can have just this, or you can do it that way, whatever you prefer. So, multiple options there. Now, tightening this down, getting that on there. So that'll go on this nut, and then you just thread that pad right on. Just like that. Keep turning, get it on there nice and tight. Crank it down, there we go. Now, we'll take out one of these pads just to show you how it works. And that's your soft Velcro side, there's your strong Velcro, your rough Velcro. Just stick that right over that pad. You see it holds it on there nice and tight. Spins good and easy. You can hear the Velcro, pulls off right like that. Now, plug it in and test it out. To a plug here. Your plug length is really long. You got a lot of you got a lot of plug there. So good long reach on that. And here we go. Fire it up. There you go. So it's spinning there. You see you can set it to go slow. And you adjust your speed right there. Make it go faster. All the way up there. That's hauling butt. So, nice buff pad there for you. So, turn it off there. And this spins freely on its own, so we'll turn it on and show you how that works. Turn that up. See? So, you can see that rotary head in there spins freely. And so that isn't necessarily spinning like tight, I can hold that and it'll vibrate. So it will spin freely on its own, so it's not gonna catch and or scratch when it's spinning there. So it's a spinning rotary head, it will spin on its own if you let it go and get it going fast enough, but free moving polishing head. These are a lot nicer than just a rotary head for that exact reason. This thing isn't like a solid spinner that's going to damage anything. So, here's how that works. Solid product. I use these a lot and looking forward to using this. There's the rundown of your product. It It's a 600 watt powerful motor. Um, the RPMs on it trying to remember what they were. It had, it's 1,500 to 6,800 auscultations per minute. So it's doing that little spin that many times per minute. So it's definitely going to polish things real good for you. Really cuts waxing time in half. So great product to have if you really like to detail and take care of your own vehicles and you get tired of waxing by hand for hours and hours, this will get the job done a lot faster. So if you like the video, hit the like button and go ahead and subscribe for me. Thanks for watching.